Developing now, three people are wounded after bullets fly in one of the busiest sections of Miami Beach. This morning, police are trying to figure out who opened fire and why. CBS 4's Brooke Schaefer joining us live from Miami Beach with the latest on the investigation. Brooke, good morning. Hey ladies, good morning. Washington Avenue here in Miami Beach was actually still closed until about 4.30 this morning and now we are getting a closer look at the scene. There's even one car parked here along Washington Avenue that has a bullet hole in it and a flat tire and I can tell you guys just beyond that as well on the sidewalk here along Washington Avenue. My photographer Brian did notice some trails of blood, even some gauze that was probably left behind from when paramedics were out here helping those three people. But let's get you some video from last night. This was around 9 o'clock here, again, 700 block of Washington Avenue in Miami Beach. Police tell us when they got here, they found three people who'd been shot. And Maribel and Francis, they also told us that they found two different types of casings out here, so it's possible there was some kind of exchange of gunfire here. At the scene, we've located at least two types of shell casings, which the preliminary information leads us to believe there was an exchange of gunfire. So right now, again, we're looking for a dark colored SUV, possibly a Jaguar with uh, possible uh, bullets, bullet holes, I should say. Officers on the scene within seconds of this call. Uh, this has been a busy weekend for Miami Beach altogether. We have dozens upon dozens of officers throughout our streets. We respond to these types of calls immediately. So, Francis and Maribel, this morning we were told three people were taken to the hospital. One of them is in critical condition this morning. As always, if you've got any information that you think can help police here, you can call Crime Stoppers 305-471-TIPS. I'm live in Miami Beach, Brooke Schaefer, CBS4, this morning.